first here if you if you just move your uh, mouse here see it will show that roof area in feet square so you need to enter the roof area in feet square in this table so here you will get the answer in gpm if you go to this side see area to be drained in meter square so if you enter the answer in meter square the answer will come in liter per second both for both answer already i have shown here the table both the table one table is for the gpm answer and square feet one table for the liter per second or meter so whatever you are entering here we have the solution so first let's say that the area is 100 meter square so like a 50 into 20 so 100 meter square so and i ended the answer in meter square so here next part r r is the rainfall intensity you have to enter in mm per hour or H, uh, inch per hour so here you need to enter in mm per hour here you need to enter in inch per hour so based on the option you can select the answer here and here is the constant value 3600 and here is the constant value so you don't need to touch that one only in this insert portion you can select okay so 3 inch means 75 mm so both the answers are same now in the moving down this is related to square feet and inches per hour and now i entered the answer in square meter and i entered the answer in liter per second i got the answer in liter per second so for our case 2.08356 is the flow so leader there are two words huh, in the storm water in this drainage pipe we discuss the stock pipe and the offset pipe when it comes to storm water leader pipe and surface runoff pipe leader pipe and surface runoff pipe or horizontal pipe you can say so first leader pipe means it's a vertical pipe so from the roof of the pipe roof of the project you can see one vertical pipe will fall no? that is called as a leader pipe so leader pipe sizing uh, in our project it is 2.08356 so here you need to first know the intensity rainfall intensity so rainfall intensity is 75 mm so for the 75 mm here you have to be there and uh, first you need to find out the maximum flow so in our case 2.08 so we exceeded we exceeded 2 liter per second we need to go with this 6 liter per second till 6 liter per second the pipe size is 3 inch so 3 inch is the pipe size but you have to verify here near to the rainfall intensity you have to verify so here what they are telling till till 272 square meter this is okay in our case it is 100 square meter so we are within the limit but you, you are saying that in our case 300 square meter but the flow is 5.2 okay just for example in our case um, 300 square meter the flow is 5.2 first what you will do 5.2 for 5.2 you will select this one okay you, are, you will take that 3 inch for the vertical pipe but when it comes to the rainfall intensity if you see here 272 but in our case it is 300 square meters so we cannot go with uh, 3 inch same like what we did for the drainage pipe sizing we cannot go with this one that means we have to go with the next size that means 4 inch is the pipe size for our the vertical pipe so now in our case rainfall intensity 3 inch uh, here the flow what we observe 2.08 so we are here and till 272 square meter we can manage so our case is only 100 square meter so the vertical pipe is 3 inch pipe the leader means the vertical pipe we, we saw that uh, here we have the rainwater outlet as scupper drain so if you see the section it will go like this now from the scupper drain so this pipe is 3 inch that we discussed now this pipe is 3 inch and this is in the limit now what will happen once it goes down it will uh, some project it will be free discharge some project what will happen all this pipe all this pipe for example this pipe will go down it will go this side here then here another pipe will come this will be connected here will be one more manual will be there here also we have one more manual will be there or inspection chamber will be there so from here it will again go here so this side another rainwater outlet will come this will be connected so this will again go to the outside of the project to connect with the existing so now we need to know what is the pipe size of the horizontal piping because that is also important vertical we discussed similarly we need the horizontal piping same like the drainage so in order to decide the horizontal piping we have another table 
that is this table same like same like drainage piping i need to mention here the percentage slope percentage of that horizontal piping this horizontal piping let's say that two percentage slope i followed for the overall so what we have to decide first the flow rate so let's say this area this area this pipe which is coming with the 2.03 for example so 2.03 liter per second mean here you know that uh, they are ask they will ask the vertical size also okay vertical liter size also okay we'll come that first two percent i followed for the horizontal piping so 2.03 liter per second is the the flow which is coming from the last piping that mean i am at this point this is still one liter per second this is three liter per second so i am at this point so moving to this side moving to this side vertical leader so vertical leader what happened this part. what they are telling vertical leader till six liter per second they can hold so in our case it is less than that only 2.08 uh, something like that so this is acceptable and that means you can verify the pipe size so three inch so what they are telling vertical pipe is three inch horizontal pipe also three inch suppose in our case first we will go with this one we'll see what is the slope two percentage in our case so we'll verify the flow okay 2.03 flow that is within this limit then we will see the equivalent pipe vertical leader so that time if it is in this range here it is this range just for example i'm telling okay let's say the next case seven liter per second okay uh, so 6.5 liter per second is the flow for example 6.5 liter per second is the flow so what i will do two percentage i will see i will tell okay this here 6.5 within the range 6.5 within the range so this size will be i will check here so here also it is within the range only 12 liter per second so this side the pipe size will be four inch so we have to verify here for the horizontal pipe same we have to verify for the vertical piping then we will go for the original piping pipe size